All right, boys and girls, today we're going to be looking at combination questions on the ACT math, really probability questions. And I don't really know what combinations mean. Really, I call them license plate questions. These show up every single ACT and you have to be ready to solve them. Let's get started. Let's take a look at a question like 44 on the left hand side here. I'll read it. It says an automobile license plate number issued by a certain state has six character positions. Each of the first three positions contains a single digit, so they're numbers, whereas each of the last three position, positions contain a letter. There are 26 letters. It says they may repeat. Ooh, that's really important. They may repeat. In that case, how many different license plates can be made? Well, understand that the first three are digits, right? These are going to be digits, whereas these are going to be letters. In that case, in this first slot, especially because these can repeat, how many digits can you choose from 0 to 9? Well, of course, that's going to be 10 digits. Again, in the next slot, you are allowed to repeat terms, therefore 10 again and 10 again. Now, what about letters? Well, in this case, there are no restrictions. Again, no, no letter has to be a certain letter. No, no, you can use repeats. No real restrictions. So this is going to be 26, 26, 26. At the end of the day, when you multiply all of these through, you should have 10 times 10 times 10 times 26 times 26 times 26. The answer is K. Really, this slot method that I use is huge. I use it every single time for questions like this. Let's try another one. Come over here with me for 48. It says... Six plants, each of a different plant type, are to be arranged on a display shelf six spots. If each plant must have a plant, if each spot must have a plant, in how many different arrangements can the plants be placed? Well, again, steal my little slot method. You have six slots on your windowsill. Therefore, let's see how this would work. Well, first of all, how many plants can you choose from in this first slot? Six, you have six plants. But now that the rose is chosen, now that the rose is placed down and you can't budge it, it's stuck, how many plants do you have to choose from in the second slot? Five. And then four. And then three. And then two. And then one. Essentially, once a plant is down, you don't really have that plant to choose from anymore. Therefore, six times five times four times three times two times one, and your answer is K. If you're a probability master, you probably know this skill as 6 factorial. Of course, 6 factorial is 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, but I don't even mess with that. I just use my logic. I just use my brain. Let's keep going. Let's go ahead to number this one. This is another really good one. And what does it say? It says, a company prints contest codes on each of a fun bag of candy, a fun size bag of candy. There are, I'm not even going to read the whole thing. What does it say? It says that there are six slots. Again, my six slots. But this one's a little harder because, oh, the first letter has to be an A. The second letter has to be an H. And then followed by four of the digits, zero through nine. Again, these are locked up already. This one has to be an A and this one has to be an H. Therefore, how much of a say did I have in this first slot? Did I have much of a say at all? No. Really, I only had one answer choice there. Really, I only had one choice. I only had one choice there. Again, digits may repeat. So how many choices do I have here? 10, 10, 10, and 10. Therefore, the answer is F. Kind of a weird one, but I am going to do one more. Come over here with me. Come over here for 51. I'm going to read this one correctly all the way through this time. It says, get a great read books is adding a new phone line. The phone company says that the first three digits of the phone number must be 555, but the remaining four digits where each digit is a digit from zero through nine can be chosen by get a great read books. How many phone numbers are possible? Well, again, steal my slot method. It says that the first digits have to be fives and then this one who cares? This one, who cares? This one, who cares? This one, who cares? But the big thing here is a lot of students choose five cubed, five cubed here, here, and here. But I would argue that's a terrible mistake. Again, these are terrible mistakes. Why? Well, it's because 
Do you have much of a say here? I thought that first digit had to be a five. I thought the second digit had to be a five. This third digit had to be a five. Therefore, you only have one choice, one choice, one choice. Whereas here you have 10, 10, 10, and 10. Again, because they repeat, you are allowed repeats. In that case, what is our final answer? The final answer is E. Please let me know if that helped for questions like this, really these combination or license plate questions. And if you have any questions remaining, shoot, me, shoot them off in the comments. I'll see you guys on the next one. All right, boys.